The final stage of the $3 billion Parramatta Square redevelopment has now been given the green light. It will compromise two 50-storey office towers that will eventually provide space for more than 12,000 workers. Skyscrapers worthy of the name, towering above Parramatta. Two new office buildings to rival Sydney CBD, providing space for thousands more jobs in the greater west. We still have a little bit to go to uh, catch Sydney, but uh, we're certainly looking to complete Sydney more than compete with it. Work on Parramatta Square began two years ago, with towers three and four slated for completion by November. Now, planning approvals being granted for towers six and eight, each 50 storeys, almost as high as the MLC centre in the city. This dwarfs anything that Parramatta's had in the past. This one project uh, probably adds more than a quarter of the entire city in one go. Worth $1.7 billion, the towers will have 125,000 square metres of floor space for a staggering 12,500 workers when complete. Despite the approval of the towers, the sky is not the limit for future high-rise buildings in Parramatta. Already an 89-storey proposal has been knocked back. Radar coverage for the new West in Sydney Airport will likely keep maximum heights at 50 storeys. I think that that's probably going to be the limit um, unless CASA decides to put in an extra radar somewhere. The first tower is due for completion by 2021, the second by 2023. Alex Hart, 7 News.